Hello, and welcome back to another Let's Play episode of Scary Nightmares. Now this is actually Little Scary Nightmares 2, which is the sequel to the other game, I guess. And we're going to play it because I have nothing better to play, I guess. I mean, I have like several other games I want to play, but I just want to do a level selection. Uh, well, I'm going to play it. And just like the last game, this is a game that's totally not inspired by anything. Trapped in prison. Do not make noise and silently get behind. This is me and my best friend, I guess. I look so weird in this. Why do I have like a weird paper bag over my head? Unless I'm based off another character, which again can't be the case. I would like kill. I just kill this guy. Hooray! All right, cool. Next level. Pick up hammer, step forward, and kill all the students that come in your way. That seems a little, a little unnecessary, but okay. Pick up. Also, why am I killing students? Nice. Oh, I like how the joystick is like much better looking than the original. Alright, next level. Across the classroom, the teacher's taking a class. Beware of all the students when choose to turn their face. Okay. Oh, this. Oh. Turning around. Great. That's awesome. Next level. I find a key lying on the co top of the cover. Anything happened, hide. Uh, top of the cover.
Okay. Yeah, she totally can't see me. Where's your friend? Go find him. He's been caught by the students. Look everywhere and kill all the students. Come. That seems very specific. Hello. Hello, little children. Who is this supposed to be based on? Is this a kid from the Monster House movie? I feel like it is. Okay, you are... There you go. This little death thing. Okay, so I gotta save my friend. The only person in the school that I trust. Okay, that's the locker. Oh, there's more of them. Gosh, there's so many of them. Again, totally not based off of anything. This whole concept. Yeah, not based on anything. Alright. I'm supposed to go here. Oh, there's my bestie. So how do I... I just open the... Oh, okay. Why are you in a cage in another in a cell? I have to see your friend and go get the key in the cages. They can search all the locker in the school. Oh, cool. I'll go until I reach the locker that has the weird button. I'm wielding the old man again. It's like the last one. Also, are these like the same students that just come back to life? Oh, nice. You have arrows telling me exactly where things are. Dude, this is a much better looking game than it should be. For a mobile game? Like, come on. It's not the worst one. Probably. Live.
Why is there an opening? It's supposed to be like a window. But it's not there. Or out of four schools are trying to kill all students trying to stop it. Oh! How would I not have this? No, no damage speed on this game. This is a huge courtyard. Oh, a huge schoolyard. Uh, something I don't need to kill you to progress, but I'll do it anyway. Realistically, you should not take more than one hit from the hammer to die. You're a small little child. Alright, cool. They open the gates. Yeah, I do. Oh! That's it. Those are all the levels. So, a much shorter experience than the first one, but I'd say overall, very good. I like how it was very original. And again, totally not based on anything. But, until then, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.